back to weekendwaters.net. Today this video is presented by Lakeside Resort and Restaurant. Please visit them at lakesideresort.net. They're located here on Table Rock Lake. They got a lot of amenities and things for your family vacations and they open here in uh, April. So uh, today we've caught a lot of good fish on the umbrella rig again. We haven't been here in a month. Didn't know what the fish were doing. The lake was iced over and we have had a very, very good day today catching a lot of uh, fish on umbrella rigs. Rich today is going to speak to you about uh, the second part of how to rig these umbrella rigs to hopefully help you guys have as good a success as we've had over the last couple months and as of today as you'll see on the video. So the weights and the rig that again we use and then this this part of it is how to rig them. Alright, what we have here is your typical umbrella rig. It's this one here. This particular one here is a suck it rig. And what we're going to do, we're going to show you how to rig it today. And this is uh, one of the weight heads that we use today. It comes right with uh, some of the umbrella rigs you buy. This one right here. It's eighth ounce. Take your swim bait, jig head, slide her in like you ate. Flip her up there, and it'll look like this when it's done. And you'll do three of them, all the same. It'll look just like that when you're done, all three of them. Then when you get them done, you have what you call a hitchhiker. But you probably won't be able to see it, it's so little. You take that, it's a spring type looking deal. Take that, stick it in your bait. And screw it on. Get it screwed on like that. Now the thing with these here is, don't screw it all the way up yet, just yet when you do your rig. Before. top of the rig, your hitchhiker, open up your clip, you really don't even need to open it up because the hitchhiker has a little deal on it, you don't do that, but once you get it on there like that, grab that, grab your bait, continue screwing the swim bait all the way up. That way you'll never, that'll never come off of there, never come off, unless a per fish jerks it off. Here's another, here's the other one, and it'll go to the other on the top side. Just clip it on, and screw it up, all the way. Okay, now there's your dummy baits on top. All right, you go back down here. You have your three baits down here that you've already rigged. Undo the clip. Slide the bait in. Clip it. And there you have that. And you will continue to do that until you get all three of them on there. Now what you have there is a fully rigged umbrella rig. the ways there's several different ways to rig them with different baits but this is one of the ways that we do
one part feels so light. Good one. Well, you hit it hard and feel good. Yeah, you can know what the fuck it is. It's pretty good. I can tell you that. Either that or it's fucking bad. Oh, man. Nice one. There's our landing here, Joe. <laughs> I got less. Yeah, give me a lot, man. You still on there? Yeah. No, that needs to be on the that needs to be on the Tighten down your reel, pro. <laughs> five pounder. Whoa, after all that mess. Small mass. Umbrella rig. I got there's another suck it rig fish. Another Alabama rig bass. No mouth. Look at that suck it bait fish. <laughs> Thank you guys again for joining us at WeCanWaters.net and watching this video. Hopefully it helped you. Please visit our sponsors to help us uh, do this. Um, Edward Jones, Lakeside Resort and Restaurant. New Tech Lures, Suck It Baits, and Purcell Tire. Thank you Thank very you. much.